What's up? What's up? What's, What's up? Poppin'? Crack a lack. And happy Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. Yep, yep. This is Just Our Opinion with Robin. Mike. And Ty. Yo, we happy to be with y'all today. Be spending time with y'all, kicking with it with y'all today. Yeah. Y'all know we on a we on a we on a vibe today right now, man. Today we're talking about situationships. Mm. Yes, I said situationships. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Can you be taken without a commitment? You know, mm. can you be taken? Without Air a commitment. <laughs> so we're going to talk this thing through. I hope yeah. y'all ready to hop in the Let's comments. I hope y'all ready to kick it with us. Because yep, we're going to yep. talk this thing through. I want to know how y'all feel about this tonight. We're going to kick it. Y'all ready, fellas? Let's, ready. Let's, Let's go. do it. Let's go. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah. 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 Uh, pardon me in my tone. Can't step to my throne. They ain't working like me. I did this on my own. You asking where we been? I don't know where to begin. All this dirt on my skin. I just came here to win. Oh. Y'all, y'all was vibing. <laughs> you, hey, know you know it. Every, every week it's a party. <laughs> Feeling the Jones and. Listen, I'm I'm kind of digging this topic today because I, I really feel like it's one that needs to be discussed. Okay. I, I feel like it's too many situationships going on around here. So we're going to make this clear for y'all. Uh, but before we get started, first of all, shout out to our sponsors, Black Spirit Legacy. Yes, <laughs> We got our fire event coming up yep. next week, next Wednesday. Week. We'll be at the Black Wednesday. Spirits event, the Taste of Black suited Spirits and event. Booted. I don't know about suited. I'm going to be fly, but I ain't going to I don't know, <laughs> know about all that. I'm going to be suited and booted. <laughs> I'm, gonna so be, I'm still going to be cuter than both I'm, of them, but you know, uh, I, don't, hey, I don't know about suited and booted. I went and bought this suit and got my spanks. <laughs> <laughs> What? I'm about to be suited and booted. <laughs> I'm about to stop. Let me find out you got a shaper on. Let me, let me find out you, you out here in the shaper. Up. <laughs> <laughs> Pretending just like all you women. <laughs> let me find I'm out. Stuff all this up in the shaper. <laughs> Gonna be looking like Listen. I got extra chest in here. <laughs> yep, suited and booted. Let Listen. me oh, find out how here next week in a this. shaper. I gotta Listen. see that. Gotta Listen, see y'all that. need to come holler at us because I'm telling y'all, I find out here in the shaper, I'm not letting them live it down for the rest <laughs> of I the can? night. It's going down. <laughs> you it's, think going, I can? it's going down. I'm gonna tell all the ladies, make sure y'all give him a hug and feel his waist trainer. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Fill me up real good. You feel mine, I feel yours. <laughs> Man, this is about to be crazy. So listen, make sure y'all come out to the event on Wednesday of next week. We gonna have some fun. We gonna kick it. Yeah. Um, y'all know y'all know Lazar. He always on the show. He gonna be in the building. Um, mm-hmm. we gonna have some good fun. A lot of the um owners and CEOs of these Black Spirit companies will be in the building as well. Yep. Uh, so make sure y'all come out and kick it and have some fun with us. Uh, then this weekend, um, we will be at the um. The Black Film, Black Film, Film Festival. Festival. Yes, yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. yes. The Black Detroit Black Film, Film Festival. Festival. Yes. Um, we still have tickets left to that event. So if you guys are interested, y'all know the rules. Y'all got to like, follow, share on two different of our sites and hit us up in our inbox. Yes. We send y'all the link to get the tickets. Speaking of the links, I ain't going to say what happened last <laughs> week, but just know that I know. No. Right. Um, but make sure y'all hit us up. Yeah, we watching y'all and we know. We know we what know. happened last week. So if you watching the show and it was you, just know no, that I know no. because I do get a count of all of the tickets that went out. So just know that I know. But that's mm-hmm. all I'm going to say about that. Yeah. Um, so hit us up uh, if y'all want to join us at the Detroit Black Film Festival event this weekend. Definitely, definitely. While y'all doing that, make sure y'all hit up our merchandise. Yes. Our, our, I say it what I I see it collection, mm-hmm. uh, our JOO shirts. If y'all want to be cute and put on a cute little suit with a JOO shirt next week, y'all should order y'all one and do that. Come rep us. Yeah, that, that'll, that'll, be be that'll, that'll be hot. That'll be dope. dope. 
Um, also, wait a minute. Before we go any further, y'all know what time it is. Before the show starts, before we get going, we got to do what we got to do. DJ, hit it. Hit it. Hey, give me a little bit of volume on that. There we go. There you go. There we go. There we go. Y'all know hey. what time it is. Y'all know what it's time hey. for us to do. What we got to do. Tell them what they got to do. Tell them what they got to do. What we got to hey. do hey. is. Hey. Shed a pay. Shed a shed a pay. Oh, shed a pay. Shed a shed a pay. Oh, shed a pay. Shed a shed a pay. Oh, shed a pay. I got freestyle, man. I'm on the west, better share that page uh, On the east, on the east, you better share that page Up uh, north, up north, you better share that page Down yeah. south, down south, you better share that page Share the page With your mama Share the page With your daddy Share, share the, the page. page With your cousin Share the page With your family Share the page With your church Share the page <laughs> With your bishop Share the page We ain't cussing, you can Share, share the page Share the page, hey <laughs> That's what's up. That's what's up. That's what's up. That's how, that's how you get the make energy flowing. Make sure, make sure y'all share this video with all of your networks. Get the word out. Their favorite podcast is on, on live. live. Mm-hmm. All right, let's kick it about these situations. Situationships. Who made that famous? Situ- okay, so listen. Um, that's an interesting word. Um. Yeah. And I'm a, I'm gonna start it with I'm gonna start it right here. If your Facebook relationship status say it's complicated, mm, you might be in a you might be in, in a, a situation. <laughs> <laughs> That's a telltale sign that the situation is going on. You might be in a situation. It's complicated. Oh. Yeah, you know, you know. Oh, it's complicated. It's or or to if it. you say stuff like. We don't define our relationship. Oh, yeah, you might be in a situation. You're in a situation. I mean, I, I'm in between. Uh uh-uh. uh. Or, you I'm know, in a hard place. You know, we're, 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 we're good trying to friends. figure it we're out. We're trying to figure, figure it, it out. out. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Titles. You, you might be in a situation. Um, we don't define. Yeah, we don't, we don't define our relationship by titles. Uh, you know what? I got a better one. Mm-hmm. If you can't post your mate Ooh. on social media, yeah. you're in a situation. Man, yeah. I agree with that. It just is well, what it is. So I, think, well, so, I, I mean, some people are private. Listen, you private, private for years. It's one thing to be you private. Be it's private. another thing to be somebody's secret. <laughs> Give okay, up my little secret. Because here's the here's the problem I have. I can't stand seeing people on Facebook or any social media site. And they, you know, I, I I don't have to post my mate to define our relationship, Man. or they, or you know, the no face, no case uh thing. The movement is and, I never heard Or you that. sitting there, you sitting there, you posting pictures at the dinner table, of you can clearly see you two plates in a person's hands, but you don't never see the person in the oh, picture. Oh no, no, they get that's them all. that's the whole story of Instagram. Nobody posts their mates on Instagram. Not nobody. And people do not post <laughs> their mates on Instagram. It's mainly themselves. So time out. My, on Instagram. my name on Instagram is Mrs. R. Okay. Hurst. There are pictures of my husband on Instagram. There's pictures of my kids on Instagram. So I think the nobody you're referring to is people well, in situations. No, I'm saying not as much as Facebook. Facebook is the post your relationship place. Instagram is post you for just in case play. <laughs> <laughs> Let me find out. You gotta be out here on Instagram. Let me find That's out. That's why they talking about it go down in a DM on Let Instagram. Let me find out. Ain't no relationship status on Instagram. Let me find out. Instagram is only a for uh, 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 only fans page. That's clean. <laughs> Let me find That's out. What, That's Let what it out. is. Hey. So that's it what you're ain't telling that me. clean because you can get some booty snaps or claps on Instagram. <laughs> hey, you Instagram go to the right page, you can Ta- see Insta- the the circle in motion. Right. So listen, let's let's dive into the question though. Okay. Can you be taken without a commitment? No. You say no. Why mm-hmm. you say no? Tell me why you say no, Ty. I'm gonna be. <laughs> Okay, okay. Taken to me is you're committed to somebody else. That's you're taken. You're off the market. Um, you can't talk to other people. You 
you in something. <laughs> yeah, you, you know. In <laughs> but so. you can't can't nobody claim me if there's if I haven't locked in some type of commitment. I knew this guy back in the day. And he came at me and told me that I couldn't date nobody but him, right? Mm. Oh, okay. But at the same time, this guy was with somebody. So what I didn't understand is oh. how you, I can't date nobody but you, but you got a whole real situation at home. Okay. You can be s- sponsored without a <laughs> But no, the word is taken because nah, at the end nope, of the day, nope, nope. at the end of the day, if I can't date anybody, I'm taken, No, right? you could be sponsored. I know. Okay. But look. If so, somebody dropping that bread on you, that don't mean you're taken. That mean you sponsor. Okay, okay. And if you sponsor, you, you can't sign no other sponsorships. You you taken. No, nah, I don't agree with I don't that. Agree with that. I don't I, agree I think, with that. I think if you if you gonna if you're gonna play that game, then you have to understand that. That's that, the role of sugar daddy. And so. And Sugar Daddy can have a home situation going on, but his little side piece. But he don't get to tell her she can't do nothing else. I don't but think the right that's fair. dollar amount. No, nah, I, I have a problem with that though. I have a don't problem take my with sugar. the fact. I have a problem with you know I gotta sleep at lo- alone every night, but you go home yeah, and sleep with yeah, her that, every that, night. I, ain't, I, don't I have a that. problem with that, and you literally are saying that. You can't do that. You you know do what I say. Do not what I do. But if I'm paying your rent, your car note, and taking care of everything else, if you don't like the rules, bounce. So you can be taken without a commitment. No, you're sponsored. But no, 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 no. <laughs> My point is okay. Let's let's take it away from sponsorships and let's put it to I don't know groceries. If if I'm not on the dang shelf to be bought, right. I can't be purchased. I can't be purchased. That's just how you're sponsored. But I don't have to be in a commitment with you if I'm sponsoring you. You can't. You can't get with nobody else. See, I'm okay. Sponsoring. See, Help us out in the comments, yeah, y'all, because I, I got I got a problem I, we with gotta, this. We got to try to make. I, I have, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to disagree with Ty on this one because I feel like. If if you're gonna make if you like I said before if you're gonna take that stance and say listen I'm paying this I'm paying this da 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 but I I can do whatever I want to do because I'm doing all the paying and I'm doing all this but you don't get to do what you want to do that nah that ain't gonna fly money talks and mm. it walks <laughs> so, I mean but you don't like the rules to I the guess game my question, roll I on. guess my question is. And any ladies that may be in this situation, y'all can help me out with this. My question is, is money the only thing that dictates that arrangement, though? Because are you minimizing what you're obviously bringing to this table, too, now? Right. Yeah. Wow. Your money so. dictates it. Yep. If you want to pay your own rent, you want to pay your own car note. So wait a minute. do what you want. Wait a minute, but you automatically assume that this person was paying bills and stuff. What well, happens? Well, I'm just if, saying what this whole if, sponsorship. No, no, no. I'm and let's again, let's step away from this sponsorship thing. Okay. We're talking about the clean situationship. We're talking about I don't want to be with you, but I don't want nobody else to come lay claims on you while I'm not ready to make right. a commitment. Well, yeah, yeah, no, you can't do that. Okay, so no. in that situation, no. so when you say, so there's a lot of formulas for situationships because this and that, the word situation, everybody's situation or situationship is going to be different. a little different. Mm-hmm. So it, it, it really depends on the terms of the agreement between the two people that's in the situation right but see what happens a lot of time and pretty much <laughs> in any situation time will tip something over in any situation somebody like kind of like the subtitle that you put out there somebody gonna catch feelings yeah and now that's when you it starts to be tailored to where i'm only getting the feelings out that i want to feel like this so that's why it's like well no nah, i'm getting closer to you so i don't want to share you with nobody else but i'm gonna still do what i want to do well, that, I would that's, guess that's the a, original situational ship would be what friends with benefits. 
Yeah, I, I guess that would be the original, original situation. Yeah, 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 absolutely. That's how it starts. Right. And then but people, people kind of mold it and then want to, to shape it and mold it to, to right. how they I think the problem with the friends with benefits, though. Ain't no problem. No, it is. Because <laughs> no, it the way friends with benefits become a problem and. Um, it's when people catch feelings. No, no, no. That's not the only time it becomes a problem. For me, the way friends with benefits becomes a problem is when you run into that situation. Situation where y'all forget the friends part. Yeah, that's like, always tough. Like it's the benefits that's supposed to be the 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 main factor here. But friends mean that I can see other people. Mm-hmm. Friends mean that I yeah. can date other people. You know, yeah, we may have something going on on the side that benefit on the side. Mm-hmm. But let's not forget the main factor here is that we are just. Friends, yep. but right? See, and that's but what I'm t- what, I, what I the reason I bring that up is because friends with benefits is not a situationship. Why yeah, isn't it? Because a friend, friends with benefits, by definition of the title, mm-hmm. is we are friends. Okay, so that's a relationship with a benefit. Yeah, that's there the is, situation. There should be no complication <laughs> past. Friend mm-hmm. and, and benefit. benefit. When it uh, when a situation ship occurs, it's a gray area between the friend and the benefit. And that's where the problem comes in. That if you keep it just friends with benefits, you're supposed to be okay with me doing whatever it is that I'm okay. doing. Okay, so and I'm supposed okay. to be okay with okay. you doing whatever it is right. that you're doing. We so you're saying right. good yeah. job. Yeah. So Let's you're go. saying situation ships is things you get in that's not clearly defined. Absolutely. Right. Absolutely. So if it's not clearly defined, you in a situation ship. So cool. So I mean, so granted, friends with benefits is not a situation ship, but um I mean, there's things that uh if you're dating and having sex, then that's your situational shit. Mm, okay. Yeah. Okay. Stuff like so, that. So, like, I mean, I, I would, I would only imagine that, um, that most of the conflict comes in when, you know, when when you have a person that don't understand the rules, or is not honest enough to honest enough to say, you know what, I was cool with this in the beginning, but I'm no longer cool. Right. With that. Right. It's right. all about being upfront, like. Like uh, it's a lot of people who get that part of it, you know, misunderstood. Like if if you gonna go out here and be in, you know, in every situation ship ain't bad. Like some people right. can thrive right. off of being yeah. in a situation ship for a while. Right. But the minute you start to actually develop something more than just like you know what uh, now I'm kind of like I want to be around you a little bit more. I don't really like the fact that I see you with other dudes. I know what our agreement was, but I'm starting to like feel a little bit more different about you, man or feet, you know, on mm-hmm. both sides. That has to be communicated so the other person had the opportunity to say, you know what, I'm either with that or I'm not. I'm either feeling that same way or I'm not. Oh, absolutely. We got a comment from Mia, and it says, if I'm the side piece and you're paying for everything, that's on you. What you're not going to do is tell me who I can be with too. Period. Yeah, that's a and I, and I, you that's know what? Dictatorship. And I agree with that. And that's where I was. You can at. agree with it all you want, but if it, if it's coming out of my pocket, then here are the set rules. If you don't like it, then you can roll on, <laughs> <laughs> roll on. See, but that's, that's see, but you want to know what's funny? You you trash talking like you know. It's it's honestly that easy, and I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but it's not because Until what happens you catch is feelings. no 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 because what happens is the minute I say let's say we're in a situation ship, mm. and the minute I say you're not about to dictate who I'm with while you know what I'm saying you decide not to make no commitment and you deciding that you're not gonna for real be with me you're not gonna dictate what I do so you do you I do me we'll meet up somewhere in the middle that sounds fine and dandy until people start being honest about what this really is because let's be very very clear there would be no room or no no reason for a situation ship if everybody was okay playing their role in the first doggone place yeah. to me a situation ship means there's one or more parties in this thing that want to have a cake and eat it too uh, not necessarily it could be 
But, well, for me, um, there, like you said, there's all types of situation of ships, but they don't necessarily have to be negative situation ships. It could be that um, right now in my life, I'm not looking to be in a commitment but I'm okay with us hanging out, dating, have a great time, and what happens, happens. If nothing happens, nothing happens. That's still a situational ship, but it's more on a evil plane or um, it's on, you know, it's a good situational ship or whatever. Right. I mean, so so for you, when you when you talk about, um, you know, being in, in, in a, a good situation... Or it's honest the, situation. Or honest situation. It's still it's still a level of communication that has to happen. Like it, it yeah. has to it has to be and both parties have to, you know, be like, listen, okay, I'm I'm rocking with that, or I'm not, I'm cool with that, or I'm not. Like you like you said, you feel like if I'm paying as long as you put that up front and say, hey, if I'm paying and I'm cashing out on you, I don't want to see you with nobody else. And right. I can go out here and do whatever I want to do. And she agree with that to that. Good luck. Man. First of all. <laughs> oh, it's some out there <laughs> that luck, agree with it. That's side um, chick etiquette 101. I mean, but. But until- even with that, you run into. I feel like situationships have a have a, a risk that a lot of people don't consider when they first go into them. And the risk is that I might, because, okay, so let me break this down. I go into the situation shit because there is something that I like about you, right? Right, right. There's something that I want to I want to keep around, and it's not necessarily the circle. I mean, you might want to say it's that, but that might not necessarily, right. that might not be yeah, all it is. Right, your situation ship can right. be. Um, Whatever. But my point is you're doing you're in this situation ship simply because there's something about you that I want to keep around. Right. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And not everybody doing their own thing sounds good in theory until that something I like about you that I want to keep around starts outweighing me. Or you doing whatever it is that you want to do. Right, right. If you because I've been in that situation ship. I've been in a situation ship where there was a clear defined you do you, I do me, we meet in the middle, and then all of a sudden it's who on your phone? Yeah. Who is that texting you? Who is that calling you? And I'm like, wait a minute, hold on. Time out. I thought we were just having fun or whatever the case may be. Right. And it ends up being a blow up because now you in your feelings because apparently yo you know your whole thing was I'm gonna go over there I'm gonna do this I'm gonna do that she gonna go to sleep and that's gonna be it no, no I'm gonna get up and I'm getting ready to go out you like <laughs> oh my god see you later bro oh my, my god she tapped you on the shoulder oh my god oh my god or, or yeah. you roll over getting comfortable and I'm like so what you about to do <laughs> right oh that's the oh my god oh my god well if you somebody that's soft like that that be you, you know you, like you catch feelings soft. if you know you the type of person that's jealous catch feelings quick possessive then you don't need to be in situational shit i agree with that yeah. i agree with that if you ain't if you can't stand the heat right stay out the kitchen so we got a comment from from jackie and it says a situation ship is a friends with benefits with one person not having that understanding I actually agree but with that. But they don't understand that the they rules. are because that we're like, in friends with benefits. I feel like a situation ship is usually one sided. I really and I totally agree with her. And shout out to Jackie being out of Facebook jail and able to Ooh. hang and kick it with us again. Welcome back. That was a long thirty day stretch. Jackie, stop getting blocked on Facebook. <laughs> so now we we congratulating criminals. <laughs> hey, hey, come get them. Come and get him. Let me tell you something. You gonna get First of up. all, come I used to, to I used to be Jackie. <laughs> I got delivered from being blocked on Facebook. I've been delivered. I be, I got delivered. I used to get blocked on Facebook a lot. So I yes, don't know who's I shot on Facebook, but they don't get sensitive. They have, they have, they, done they have. So. But no, in all seriousness, um, what from what she said was, it's you like okay. For example, if you got two people that's in a, a situation or friends with benefits or whatever it is, mm-hmm. usually only one of their Facebook status say is complicated. The other one says single because it's only complicated to you. You know what I'm yeah. saying? 
Like, it's usually one person that's in a situation ship, you know, or, you know. Because they disagree into the terms because they because rather, they want to be they with you. I'd rather have, rather have than some have, of you than, than, than of not have any right. of that's you. Right, that's great. Yeah. Or, or, unfortunately, you got that situation where I, I'm trying to, I'm going to ride this out with the hopes. That you change. That. This, yeah. this evolves. Yeah. You know yeah, what I'm saying? That's typically on the lady side. Here we go. No, that's not. Here you know go. how many dudes I done had trying to be with me hoping I was going to be a better yeah, person? Yeah, want to be your wait, friend. Wait, no, no, no. I'm talking way, way. Let, let's be clear. I'm yeah. talking way, way back way, in the day. Way, way, back in the day. Way, you know, way, past way, life, past way, life. Way, but I done had. Now, no, I'm talking about not the guys that will stay your friends forever for the no, hope to get a no, chance. No, no. Tyrese, I'm talking about full blown situationships. Like I told you, this is what it is, right. and you he decided that around. you wanted to stick around with it is what it is, hoping that one day I would realize that you treat me better than all the rest <laughs> of them, and I should really be he with you. You do have, you know what I'm saying? Look, I've had my start right. five fighting for the doggone MVP of the season. We, <laughs> you do have <laughs> some guys like that, but when we're talking about. Um, who's more like that, men or women? Women are known for feeling like they can change somebody. Like a guy can tell them up front what they are and what they are all about. And what she would hear is that if long enough, if I stick around, I can change this I have person. a problem with you making that about sex because I've I didn't say it's about sex I'm just uh, when I, honey, 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 when I said sex you don't you do know that the uh, word yes. sex means something <laughs> other than physical right no get him like, you, you do realize he said that no he said no sex can mean male or female. female you know it doesn't ne- we're not necessarily talking about we intercourse not, we're not talking about the 1970s I, no 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 I no, don't no, no. believe your sex defines you no what I'm telling <laughs> you is yes, what I'm telling you is that guys are just as likely they may not be the the ones that society has dictated as the oh I'm gonna change him or the the fixers but guys are just as darn likely and trust me my if my past life ain't teach me nothing it taught me that men are just as likely to hope that they're gonna be the the change in her or the you know she's gonna realize that I'm the one here, here yeah here. I'd say she's it gonna, happens on both gonna, sides no no but no but you said it's more likely to happen it is with women, more likely and, women and I think that I think again that's situational and that's what your experience is because you may not be that type of guy but for me as Lord for me in my I house as for type. me in my house as for me and my looks as for me and my body as for me and my swag I ran into that ninja a lot <laughs> hey that's cool so I, 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 I here's what I feel about that here's what I feel about it it's like we are quicker to be um, more territorial like we we'll, we'll get We'll agree yes. to the situation. Yep. Yeah, we are and soon as, and, and soon as we feel like we start catching the feelings, like you said, Robin, like, um, who who on your phone? Or, you know, those questions. Who you texting? Who you texting? Yeah, because that, that because, calling so, you? So, so, so what because happens we're is, territorial. So, so yes. what happens is, is that. And we're competitive. This, right. And it's like, you know what? I don't want you, you know, with nobody else or this, that, and other. And we know that she, I already know, I'm, I may be number three of the five. And I know that if I come at her a certain kind of way, I'm gonna blow. I'm gonna lose my spot, my my, my third spot. So what I got to do is try to change her to make her realize, like you don't need them other dudes, Mike. So I'm in constant competition. What I'm trying to tell y'all is, I've literally been sitting up with a dude. My phone blowing up. It's a Friday night. My phone blowing. Right. It's blowing because everybody trying to figure out what Hollywood doing right. tonight. My right. phone blowing. Right. And I had to do. Look, who is that? Keep calling you. Wait a minute. Yeah, because we're territorial. Why don't you go home to what you got? Why right. you asking me who on right. my phone? Right. Right. Uh. Uh-uh. Uh. I'm. A, you know what? Let's 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 have dinner. Let's go to the movies. <laughs> now you trying. Now you trying to get me to hang out with you to the wee hours at this point because you trying to lock he down my re- night. He don't want to. Re- because you know, if you leave by midnight, there's a still a possibility I'm gonna walk out this door. Right. So now you trying to. I'm. A, you know what? 
Okay, we had dinner. Let's watch this movie. I was thinking about this movie. Yeah, we done should seen watch. Times. You done but seen this movie thirty seven times, and now you trying to. And mm-hmm. my point is, guys are just as likely. I don't. That's the one. I do believe that guys will do stuff like that because we're territorial. I don't think we're just as likely. I do think women do it a lot more than guys. Try to change. You can, it. T- yeah, because you can tell a woman all day, every day that she's Tuesday. And then she'll pop up on Thursday <laughs> with with dinner. Like I just thought that you you may be hungry and I wanted to do something nice for you. And then you looking at her like you was Tuesday. It's Thursday. Yeah. And then she get mad when she look in your house and you got Thursday over. Ta. And she like Ta. Who is that? Again, I feel like you from your experiences putting it off on women and I think it's just as likely to have both I had a dude look one dude sleeping on on my couch and literally legit was sleeping on the couch like legit was sleeping on the couch Tuesday come back to crib and see Thursday's car outside now he blowing up my phone bamming on my door you know what I'm saying I've been there yeah. and there situation was a relationship sound dangerous there well, was a clear definition was that you smoother than that. Situation I was smoother than that dangerous. so well, I well the problem Tuesday. was I wasn't trying to head because I'm grown Honest, right, right. Honestly, but you no, don't no, have no. to you don't have to hide but you just have to understand the personalities of people that people get possessive and people get jealous so why have that um why have it that Tuesday and Thursday run into each other? So it was a couple of rules that I would stick by within my gaming. So one, I'm going to teach you young brothers out there. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Ladies, and I'm, I'm next. sure Michael <laughs> have heard this. So this is way back in my day. Back in my day. Way, 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 way back. back way day. back. Okay. So... <clears throat> <laughs> so the one thing when you go out or whatever and you end up getting a number or whatever of the finest chick understand this fellas understand this <laughs> even though you got her number she probably got 15 to 20 other dudes trying to holler at her as well so you got to understand the fact that you are not the only one that's number one okay that's you're just off one. rip you're, you're number not one. the only one okay so number two the things that you do have to be different than what two through 15 is doing as well okay so you know back in my day back in my day we used to guys would take ch- chicks to dinner and stuff like that yeah, all that kind all of the, stuff the movies stuff like that and it was typically on friday or saturday at night time you know stuff like that which was normal you go out to eat you they go to expensive dinner and stuff like that you try to impress her which is cool but understand because your number in that 15 she probably had 15 other guys mm-hmm. trying to take her out for dinner so first don't ever take her out on Friday or Saturday. Mm. Never. Because all the other guys are going to do that. And those are prime getting new chicks days. <laughs> <laughs> so don't, t- don't take them out on Friday and Saturday. You need to be adding to your roster on Friday and Saturday. <laughs> nope. Guy. No. Okay. <laughs> Just okay. got to understand that. So you take them out Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Not Sunday or Monday. Sunday, she at church. She thinking about all the sin and she did on Friday and Saturday. <laughs> so she trying to get clean. Monday, she God. tired. <laughs> so it's, it's Tuesday, just Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Can I, Tuesday, can I Wednesday, Thursday. Can I interject? Sure. Um, let me get you some female game now, because I know back in the day you thought you was just the smoothest thing running with this I little, was. with this Tuesday, Wednesday, mm-hmm. Thursday thing. Let me explain something, I'm to about you. To especially hit you. especially for us career women. If we go on a date with you Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, it wasn't because we liked you. It wasn't because we thought your game was good. It's because we didn't feel like cooking. <laughs> <laughs> that's cool. So that's continue. Cool. Wait, okay, hold on, hold on. That's, that's cool. <laughs> so continue. You know why else? So continue. Because Tuesday, <laughs> I'm just telling. No, and I'm. As a woman, like you I'm said, put y'all Monday, we, Monday we tired. Friday and Friday and Saturday, our phones is blowing up like yeah, crazy. Okay, okay. Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, we was just as tired, but we was like, 
I could eat. Uh, yeah, I guess I could eat. Yeah. But, okay. <laughs> see, you see what she said? I can eat. She's still thinking about what the sucker's going to do on Friday, Saturday. You ain't taking her out to eat. No, 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 player. No. <laughs> Suckers do that. No. Here he goes. No, 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 no. <laughs> uh-huh. what, what do they do? What so, are they supposed to do, Ty? And it's okay she feel like she don't cook. The point of the date, you trying to get her to talk about you, whether good or bad. The talking about you is what you want her to do, because if she talking about you to her homegirls, she ain't talking about two through 15. Uh yeah, that's a bad move, fellas. No, Don't no, listen. No, it's a bad move. Mm-mm. Oh, a bad move. You will hit them boots and let's. This is a bad. This nope. is a this bad. Is bad this Robin. is bad. What do you, what do you see wrong with this, this game plan? Okay, let's, all right, all right. Just, I ain't even finished. Let me dissect this a bit. Let me dissect the date. Let me dissect this a bit. Wait, wait. Let me let me finish. Okay. So this is now where you take her. You want her to take her somewhere where she can do a lot of talking. Okay. Because if she do a lot yeah, of talking. He failed with me already. She going <laughs> to tell you everything you need to know to get them boots. The more you get her to talking, the more you act like you interested he failed. in her stupid little life. He failed. <laughs> Whatever problem she Why got going failed. on. Why her life got to be stupid? He time? Because failed. you don't care about it. I, you, he you, failed. You, but women you. like to talk about he themselves. Has, that's a lie too, but go ahead. Okay. This is no, you know what I good. think. I, I think hop in them comments, what, women. Y'all want to know what me my y'all problem don't like. is? Let, wait, wait. I can prove the point <laughs> that women like to talk about themselves. Okay. Who talked the most on this podcast? Because it's my shit. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, women no. like to talk. Let me explain something to you. They like to talk. Let me explain something Uh-oh, to you. Oh, here we go. Yeah. When it's called, yeah. when it's Tell called, me what I need when to it's know, called, Robin. Whatever the hell the title is with Ty, then Ty get to talk the most. But as long, but as long as it's just our opinion, the name I came up with, with Robin, whose name is first. And Robin's vision, Robin's money, Robin's time, Robin's uh, Robin's move. When it becomes Tyrese's, Ty can do the hell he want to do. Still, but as long as it's proof. just our opinion with Robin and whoever the hell else is at this table, because let's be very clear, dude, you can be replaced. That's Robin's still name is proves, first on the marquee. That still All right, proves keep my going. point. You keep going. Women like to talk. Keep going. Keep Give going. them to talk. It don't matter keep if going. it's good or bad. Keep going. <laughs> Let them talk. Keep going. <laughs> Cause Keep guess going. what happened After she argue with you About who show it is Then she gonna call her girlfriend At the end of the night No I and ain't still be talking You do realize you. <laughs> Still Yeah nah so, so that's good Nah She ain't talking about 2 yeah. three, 15 So let me Okay let me Let me poke <laughs> holes in your story Let me poke oh, some holes in, Let me poke some holes in your story okay, hold on hold on First of all Let me get you First of all the first hole I'm a poke in this, I'm going to start from the bottom up. Because the first hole I'm a poke in this is to talk to my girls about you. You could literally go through me and my girls, uh, our text message feed. Mm-hmm. We don't give a damn about y'all. Mm. Like, to be quite honest with you. And right. you get to, you be, as, a per, as a certain type of person. Now, don't get me wrong. You got those females that's in the world that that type of little crap works with. But then you got the ones that's kind of been about that life all lay life. And at the end of the day, once I get that meal that I didn't feel like cooking, this is- I'm on to something else. Hmm. So wherever it was so- that you thought that you was going to take me to get to talking, it's like, I don't, first of all, it's nobody on this earth that I for real like talking to. And I'm a, that's just being real. And I, I'm married and been married seven years and got two kids. And I don't know nobody I like to talk to. Mm-hmm. I don't like talking to people. First of all, okay. All right. All right. All right. Let me tell you. Okay. I, I don't want to be bothered with nobody like that. So that's just, that's first, that's the first hole in your story. So trying but to get me, already trying to get me to, to go somebody. Date. Yeah, but committing to the date does not mean I got to sit there and pour my life story out to you. Who the hell are you? You ain't got to pour your life story out. <laughs> Who are you? 
no. But nobody is going out on a date just eating and staring at each other. Listen. So you getting intel is exactly. what you're saying. You're you trying just, to grab the intel. Exactly. And you feel it like ain't gotta because, be you Mike, pouring out you your Mike, story. Mike, Mike, how well do you know me? Pretty well, right? Mm-hmm. It ain't got to be you pouring Wait out your story. The point is having you do what majority is my rule? of the conversation. What is my general rule about conversations and people calling me and asking me stuff? What is my general rule? Get to the point. I Cut only answer the questions that I'm asked. Yeah, get to get the to point. The point. Yeah. No get, I ain't got time point. for this. The filler talk. Look, I don't like filler. I've never liked filler conversations. Well, I mean, that could be. I'm not a small talk person. I've never been a person that enjoys small talk. I don't like filler conversations. If you ask me a question, you better be very, very specific on the information you want to know because I'm literally only going to answer the question that you ask me. And that might be the hood in me. That might be the little bit of gangsta in me that's not going to indict not, myself. Well, see, <laughs> I mean, that's why you were able to, back in the day, way, 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 way. Wait, 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 back but in the day. Again, operate like that because you've seen uh, it's a little bit different for you, Robin, because you've seen a lot. I hate to say it, but like, I saw y'all. Yeah, like, you, you, you I got a y'all. lot of, yeah, so it was like a lot <laughs> of stuff that you, that stuff just never so it's, it's, it's works different. For me. It's just different. So, and because we taught you the game. Y'all got to remember, <laughs> I've known Ty. I've known Ty since I was a little, little girl. We taught you I've known him since I was a little, little girl. And Mike is my cousin. So I will credit you on that, Ty. You're absolutely right. It may be y'all thought that that wouldn't work on me. (laughs) But what what, what he's saying is that... Majority women. Okay, I go We'll go with the whole, like... And and it is generally, like, if you look at it from that standpoint, like, women that had, like, older brothers, it's hard to... To come at them a certain way because they already know. Well, well, yeah. you. But you yeah. want to know something real though? And of course the, that. Like quite honestly, if you calling me on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday talking about a date, you already on the I got to watch this ninja list because you already on the you done pulled yourself away from regular date days. And I'm like, what you got going on on Friday and Saturday that you trying to be in my face on Tuesday? Oh, you come up with a good line. Because I go to work Monday through mm-hmm. Friday. You know what I'm saying? I, I got stuff to do. So what do you have going on on Saturday and Sunday you just hit them, you that just you hit them with in like, my face hey, on I'm Tuesday? I'm just trying to be respectful of your time. I know you, you know, you But you couldn't be trying to be respectful of my you time calling me after better work. Lie. Got to come up with a you better You calling me after that. I done worked 10 hours and been bothered with 37,000 people and now you want to. D- and I know you don't want to cook, so I'm bring a meal off. Drop some food off. <laughs> That's still cool. <laughs> drop some food off. And I ain't talking about come in and drop. No, I mean, you can go if <laughs> you care. You have to know. No, Thank you, You door dash. <laughs> you can drop, <laughs> drop my food and dash. You, you can dash. drop food off. That's a cool, inexpensive first date. But you don't drop dinner food off. No, no. Dinner food is too expensive. Drop lunch off <laughs> through, like she said, door dash. Oh, I just was... Wondering if you needed to eat. So I'm just going to send you some DoorDash. But you want to be even more of a player? If she's an office chick, you know what you do? Ooh, I had a rough day this morning, and I figured maybe you would too. So I'm I'm just going to send you this $10 Starbucks gift card. Go get yourself some coffee. I don't know what. Why would you be sending me Starbucks in the middle of the day? No, this is in the morning. You were supposed so to do you that. Did it. You, you were supposed to do that on my way to work. Is the most ex- <laughs> yes. Dinner is the most expensive. Mm. Then lunch. If you really want to get in real good, send her that Starbucks coffee. Boy, these in the morning. This situ- these situations done develop. They done got complicated. <laughs> yeah, that's done? why it's complicated. Because, Listen, like I said, you, you we got- done missed. We done, we got to pay some bills, Ty. Yeah. Oh, we, we got to pay sweating. some bills. He's sweating. <laughs> well, I he got on his sweater. Over here. You know not to wear the I'm okay sweaters. Look, shout out well, to everyday I'm okay. Today. But I'm just saying, shout out to everyday I'm okay because they sweaters is like wearing winter coats. I don't know why you in the studio with that big thick sweater on. Well, but go ahead. I, I had to wear a hat because my hair not done. Because I want to make sure I'm extra crispy. Done. Your hair not done. You play. As much as I pay AJ for my <laughs> hair touch, yes, done. I get my hair done. Play the, play the commercial. Yes. Play the commercial. Just go to commercial. 
A Taste of Black Spirits is an event that supports, highlights, and brings awareness to African American beer, wine, and spirit brands for the purpose of worldwide distribution. Presented by Black Spirits Legacy, The Garden Theater, Young Village, Buddha Foods, U.S. Media, Baltimore Entertainment Group, and Funny Actor Entertainment. Join us Wednesday, September 29th at The Garden Theater. Tickets are available on Eventbrite. Look up Taste of Black Spirits on Eventbrite. All right, I'm sorry, y'all. We got ourselves together. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. we good. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> so y'all like, know it ain't a good show unless me and Ty go to blows once. <laughs> it ain't no, a good show. It's all good. What, anybody in the comments? We got any comments? We got a lot yes. of comments. All right. Look, okay, okay. We so was let's, over let's here. Do that. We was let's fighting. Do that. Let's do we that. was fighting. Yeah. <laughs> ding, 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 ding. Neutral corners. Neutral corners. We good. So we got a comment from Dante. Okay. And it says, go. but if you doing all this and you get to this point, say they go, say they give out a BDR. Now they really going nowhere. Okay, run that back. If you out here, you do all of this, right? You okay. go through this whole game Ty talking about. Right. Yes. And then you mess around and pass out a BDR? Oh, no. That it's, they oh. give you a BDR? Yeah. Well, see, Dante, that's why you sending them coffee. So if it is a BDR, you didn't invest that much into the chick. So you saying that's you why you're not taking her out? No, if she give you a BDR. Which means you had to. Y'all do know know what a BDR is, right? Well, I mean, BDV (laughs) then. Or BVR. No. 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 See, y'all still using it wrong. Right. No, BVR. No, no, y'all obviously don't know what the acronym means. I know what it is. The acronym means bad D Mm, report. That's why I said BDR. I would be. No, so the woman Woman would give a a BDR. The man would give a a BVR. It's like getting wrote up, Ty. <laughs> yeah. So, Don't yes. be retarded, so, Ty. It's like getting was, wrote up. If you was giving her a BBR, you didn't invest that much money in her in the first place. So it's okay. Because you can, you can be cool with a BBR if you only spent coffee. All right, check this out. Check this, this out. Guy. Check this out about giving a BDR, real, real honestly, especially if it's the first time. If we like you like that... We may give you an opportunity Listen, to redeem yourself. I'm a witness because hey, that was my saving grace. Yeah, well, we'll give you that. an opportunity to redeem yourself. If Sometimes like you, you just be nervous. Yeah, we, we'll you let you be redeem off, yourself. You be off of your game. You if we like you, we'll let you redeem yourself. Just have a stable. So if you get if you get doing a BDR, then better luck on the next. <laughs> so we got a comment from Jackie, and she says, Ty, I hate to let you know, but women already know if we're going to give you some. Only thing you can do only thing you can do is talk yourself out of it. And that Jackie. is 100% true. You can't talk she yourself out of it. Yes, that is 100% true. That's why I said, Jackie, wherever you take them, make sure they're doing majority of the talking. <laughs> so they can tell you everything you need to know to slide on up in there. Oh, and it's funny because Jackie X also made a comment that says, uh, also, if you taking me out on a Wednesday, you already suspect to be. I said that. Actually, I'm already suspect to you in the first place because I'm a dude trying to hit it. <laughs> <laughs> so I now think- I'm a little bit more suspect because it's a Wednesday. But but know that I got my lie already pre-prepared for why I can't take you out on Friday and Saturday. And what is that lie, Ty? Oh, I do a oh, plethora oh. of lies. <laughs> it's my kid's birthday party. <laughs> it's my cousin's nephew's birthday, so I got to take my kid on a play date. Or oh, I throw him out there. <laughs> Stuff that's believable. Lord have mercy. So, so if I look at you and be like, okay, it's or fine. I'm going, can, I'm it's going fine. Out we can out do of something t- next Saturday. I'm going out of town on business, and I leave. <laughs> All right, that's fine. We can do it next Saturday. I'll it's cool. be out I of town no on business. We can do it the Saturday after that. Uh, I'll see what I can do. See, right there, you just cut yourself off. No, because no, I'm not going to remember a month because down here's the, the line. And that's my point. Here's the problem. And this is, this is where y'all run into issues trying to outthink us. Mm-hmm. Because we'll play that game with you. Okay. Just to see how long it's going to Just go. to see how long you going to go. Because if you keep avoiding Friday and Saturday nights to me, if you keep having something come up on Friday and Saturday, I'm you we know. automatically done called you out now. Mm-hmm. You done automatically ruined yourself. Yeah. 
I agree with you. And that was the reason why I said. Keep a stable. Keep a stable. It's a, cause dating for, okay, women have options. Dating for guys is a numbers game. We, it ain't, we go find one and we put everything in that one and they don't know. You know how you be, you know how you We got to spread it out and. You know how, you know how you be talking about, you know, ladies hit you in the DM and stuff like that. I didn't say ladies. No, no, no. Like, you know, hit the DM, stuff like that. You know, you know, hey, yo, hey ladies. Would you like to know why out of the 4,000 people that watch our show every week, you ain't never had nobody do try to hit you up in our DM? Yeah, because I'm an asshole and I'll be on here and, <laughs> and say so-and-so hit me in the DM. That's, it's not about you. people don't want. It's not about you saying so-and-so hit you in the DM. It's basically because you put your cards on the table. And the moment you show your hand, you're worthless to us at that point. But, but because just like y'all like okay, to chase, so do okay. we. And I absolutely but agree he, with you. But you know Chase, what? You're worthless You can to never us. say, I didn't tell you in the beginning. But yo, Desert, never, listen. Never. You ain't got to say about us telling us, saying you ain't told us. It's your Desert D that's pissed at you, ain't uh, us. I ain't, got, I ain't got no Desert D. <laughs> it's your Desert D that's pissed at you. I've been, you not us. like you said earlier, I've been delivered. <laughs> and no, no, Serene. It ain't us. But the thing about Ty, you get what you see. I ain't about to lie to you. Yeah, I ain't about to cook up nothing smooth. You just said you gotta have a lot. I said way back, 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 back in my day. In my grown days, I tell you straight up, we in a situation of shit. If we go out on a date and you tell me some stuff that you don't do, I douche you right there. Like it was nice meeting you, but it ain't gonna work. (laughs) And you think I can? You hop in my DMs, you know the real, and it's going to be some real, and you ain't getting no BDR because I puts it down. Listen, <laughs> if any of our followers, if I now see any, let me, let me, let me, public hold service on, announcement, on, I need a close up. <laughs> if I see any of our followers, anybody that watch our show, anybody with this ninja in our DM asking for this ninja or anything. That you just sword. don't look at him and say you got what you deserve. Oh Jesus! Listen, first of all, you know I'm rude. <laughs> <laughs> I, I am rude. Oh wait, hold on. Sorry. At the end of oh, the no. day, listen, I am savage, <sighs> and I'ma call you a whore. I'ma tell you you a whore. I'ma be like. I know what you do because you knew who this ninja was. No, I'm just, no, my thing, I'm a good Ty, guy. it's okay. We know you mess with horse. And let's move back to our topic. <laughs> and I would date you. We would have a phenomenal time. There we go. Trips and everything because I like to have fun. But I'm just going to be honest about it. I'm not going to beat it. I'm not going to beat around the bush. I'm not going to do crap. Just for the sake Ooh, of doing crap. Wait a minute. It is a comment on here to say, Ty, you look like you boring. <laughs> oh. Well. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. From a teenager, really. Uh, she's damn near 30. <laughs> she's, still a, she's still a teenager in my book. And you know, Ty, I'm going to tell you, that's one of my superpowers because I look innocent. No, you don't. All the way. She said, just said I look boring. People don't think there's any, um, what you call that, any risk with dating the boring guy See, whatsoever. Nice guy. I get yeah. that with the nice guy. Until, you, I get that until with the they nice get guy. into it, and then they like, oh, my Listen, God, I, I don't know what happened. Nice if you date Ty, you ain't never watched this show a day <laughs> in your life. <laughs> You yes, ain't never even skim through the comments. But see, you want, you but back that. in the day, I will say this: you want to have like some fun. Good hop girls in my DM. like bad boys. Maybe I ain't never been a good girl then, because y'all could kiss every inch of my behind. That, I'm just saying, the good girls like the bad boys. Us nice guys always finish last. That till you get a little edgy. I'm not saying go full blown tie. But <laughs> when you be well, when Jackie you little, out there said on a Wednesday, yes, Jackie, you can hit me up on a Wednesday. I don't, <laughs> that think, that's don't think that's what, what she, she meant. Was I don't care that what she meant. So not what she <laughs> said <laughs> on a Wednesday, you can hop in my DMs okay. on a Wednesday. Can we Jackie. can we switch okay. this back to the you actual can get a situational? Uh, can we shut this one up and switch this okay, back so to the we, actual so, topics? Okay. Okay. Do y'all know it is eight fifty six? Is it really? We do now. Yep. Okay. So okay. So let me say this. 
don't can I, we can do final thoughts? Yeah, go ahead. Okay, so don't get in a situation if you cannot play that whole game out. If you like Ty was saying earlier, if you're not conditioned for that level of of sit, being in that type of situation, don't play the field. If you know you're jealous, if you know you're gonna get clingy, if you know you know you have a hard time seeing, you may agree with it in the beginning, and if you do. Whenever your whenever your feelings change, communicate it. Point blank period. Tell the other person so they had an option to know if they want to deal with it or not. Ty. Um, all my ships is situations. <laughs> <laughs> it's something in his drink. No. Juice. <laughs> all I brought to this table today was juice. Well, it juice. must be the sugar. <laughs> No, here's just what I'm saying. Like I said before, if you date me, then you're going to know the real from the beginning to the end. We're going to have a great time. We're going to go out. We're going to do stuff. It's just going to be fun, but we're going to know what it is from the beginning to end. There's nothing for you to figure out. You don't have to decode anything. I say you want to know something about me, ask you. I'm going to tell you directly. How is this a fun? The topic. Hey, we talking about situational shifts. I'm talking how about is this my fi- situation. How is this okay. a final thought on the topic? Hold on, Go ahead. <laughs> and I said what I said. <laughs> situation. <laughs> okay, it's the juice. It's not mine. Hey, do me a favor. Mute his mic. <laughs> Can't do nothing. About it. Thank you. Um, let's let the let the adults talk now. <laughs> Go ahead, Robin. Um. So, for me, these things can be kind of complicated. Um, I'm with Mike on this one. You have to be honest. You have to be upfront. Um, if the dynamics of the the agreement change, whoever changed the dynamics of the agreement needs to be honest with the other party. What that also means is you don't get in a you don't get to dictate who a person sees, who a person calls, who a person text messages and still be able to do what you want to do as well. It's not fair in any situation. Situationship Friends with benefits, whatever you choose, you and it's complicated, uh, uh, entanglement, whatever it is that you choose to call it, it's not fair for you to dictate all aspects of that thing. There has to be a clear understanding and a mutual agreement, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. not a one sided agreement, not a tie agreement, <laughs> a mutual agreement about what we're going to do, how we're going to do it and how we're going to move forward. Because what happens is if you play that wrong and you don't have the mutual agreement, you're going to end up in some a thin line between love and hate type stuff I'm and trying bricks. to figure out I'm why you in the hospital. I'm on bricks. And I said what I said. I'm on bricks. Look, we Woo. thank y'all. You can cut his mic back on now. Woo. I mean, you said the exact same we thing. We thank y'all for kicking it with us tonight. <laughs> um, we thank y'all for rolling with us. We appreciate y'all. We'll see y'all at the event on Wednesday. Woo. It's going to be fire. We're going to have a show. We're going to have some fun, man. Um, this has been Just Our Opinion with Robin Pauls. Mike. <laughs> and the one y'all come to see, Ty. <laughs> We out. <laughs> He'll be on vacation in October. And I'm a, you know what? It's funny because we, we gonna do the show when he on vacation, literally without a third guest, and see if there's no dead air and you can and, and we can actually hold it. Because y'all couldn't do it without like, me. Like we y'all did. tried that already. Y'all like couldn't do it without me. The whole stage, yeah. the whole doggone show was dead air and um you, and yeah, yeah. Well, I was thinking um and maybe we should and. You you're right. We couldn't do it without Y'all you. Y'all couldn't do it because without women me. like to talk, and no, they no, would no. tell you everything you need to know <laughs> to get in so, them draw. In October, in October, we gonna kick this thing off with and and take the sticky note off and see if we can do Circle. it how it was originally done. Look, it, we appreciate Circle y'all brothers. for kicking it with us today. We love it. We love y'all. Peace. Peace. Just our opinion. Just our opinion with Robin, Mike, and Ty is available on YouTube, Instagram, Apple Podcast, Spotify, Google Podcast, Amazon Music, Facebook, and many more. Join us live every Wednesday at 8 p.m. or listen to us wherever you enjoy podcasts.
and please like, share, and follow.